Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, so the beginning of this video is going to be a bunch of montage of uh, riding around with my cousin and side by side. And then after that, it's going to be me on the dirt bike, getting back home. And uh, it was a fun journey. And I hope you guys enjoy it. Oh, don't do this one? Why is it so high? I don't know. You need moves. You need moves? We'll get it later. Don't worry about it. Right. That. I got two eyes. Don't hit me! Get it, boy! I'm not gonna fly because one, I got a flat tire. And two, I can barely see right now. Like, 
I got two eyes. Funny light for my headlight kit that I built. Just gotta get out of here, cruising down the road, and then we'll be good. Gotta sit on the gas tank, keep as much weight off the rear tire as possible. their way. Light, see, like so. That way, that could be like my low beam, and then this could be my high beam. But we're about five minutes from the house now, and uh, yeah, so we're doing great. I hope the other guys have made it home, or at least are on the right track. I have not seen no one since they turned off back there. So I'm hoping they made it back. Or at 
guys go? I went the way we went the first time with Nick. Yep. I went through Irondale and then up through Salt Run. I think that's them right there. <laughs> yeah, when I finally got on to uh, Clark's Mill here, I'm just like, thank God I made it because I'm in the middle of the wilderness. I'm pretty sure Bigfoot was trying to track me down. And I'm like, I know I don't, I know I have gas. This thing does good. But I'm like, I got no cell phone. No service. I couldn't even get a hold of you Yeah. I'm like, if I needed a light, I'd have to rip this back off. <laughs> I was just like, oh. Alright, they made it back. Everyone ended up taking different routes. But we all made it back. Glad no one got hurt. Uh, my wreck, yeah, I mean, it, it hurt for the moment, but whew, that was uh, something else. I went flying all because I thought I was going to be cool and rip on up through the trail, and I went soaring on my side. But once again, hey, there's some deer out there. Actually, there's like five, six of them out there. Holy crap, there's some more! guys but uh no this bike did excellent again we're gonna definitely look into getting one of those like foam inserts for the rear tire that way we don't have to worry about a tube the front one's not too bad I, I, it's not gonna hit anything that bad and you got full shocks up, the, up front but definitely fun had an excellent time we'll assess the rear rim tomorrow morning but we're calling it quits tonight so it's the next day it rained last night uh so the bike did get rinsed off a little bit it's not nearly as muddy as the last time we went riding but we i also didn't ride it as much because well one i rode with my cousin two i blew the back tube out of it but the rim at least the uh, face of it right here looks perfectly fine on both sides so that didn't get all dinged up uh, when I take this rear rim off to do a either tube or a uh, like foam insert I'm going to throw it up on my truing stand that I made and make sure it's all good I uh, check all these spokes there's some that are a little questionable like they need to be tightened a little bit Nothing like super loose, so that's good. We'll go ahead and probably get a new tire also. I mean, this ain't terrible, but it's starting to chunk. So we'll probably just get a new tire. But other than that, had a great time. Made it back in one piece. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, we had an awesome time. It was a lot of fun. Making memories with everyone. Uh, everyone made it back safely. I uh, got a couple new parts for the dirt bikes, so we'll be putting them on and that, but uh, a great time. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll catch you guys next time.